Hi you guys, I hope you are doing well and are ready for some yoga this morning. So go ahead and get your mat set up, cat and dog optional. Um, and then come on all the way down into a comfortable cross-legged seat, sit up nice and tall. Go ahead and bring your hands in your lap. That was a good time, take a drink if you'd like. And I'll give you guys just a moment to see if anyone else is gonna pop on and join us this morning. All right, you got your watch, go ahead and start it so you know we are on track to stay on time and you can get on with all the festivities of the day. So make sure you're sitting in a comfortable seat long and tall through the spine and go ahead and just close your eyes have your hands in your lap in whatever way feels comfortable for you you can have them resting on your knees right in the center you can even begin to connect thumb to any finger that feels comfortable if you'd like so again just focus on that breath sitting up nice and tall take a big inhale in through the nose and exhale, let it go. Inhale. Exhale. Keep it going. In. Out. One more just like that. In. And out. Great. Go ahead and bring your left hand to your heart, right hand to your belly. Again, sit up nice and tall. Take a big inhale. And exhale, let it go. With that next inhale, I want you to really feel your entire upper body expanding as you push that oxygen to the base of your lungs. Inhale. And exhale, let it go. Inhale, really big expansion. Exhale, let it go. One more, just like that. In. And out. And just go ahead and release your hands back onto your legs. And we're going to stay here for several more moments just focusing on that breath. Noticing what's going on in your body. And really start to calm yourself, center yourself. Make sure with your exhale you release your shoulders down your spine. Give your legs a little wiggle, releasing them. And even bring a smile onto your face as we breathe. And take two more breaths here. Great job. You can open your eyes and follow the instructions or you can keep them closed and just listen to my voice. Take a big inhale, lift your arms all the way up, look up. Big stretch. And as we exhale, float your arms down to your side, tuck your chin into your chest. Inhale, lengthen, look up. Exhale, float them down, tuck your chin. Inhale. And exhale. One more, in, holding it at the top this time. And as we exhale, just release that right palm down to the floor, really lengthen through that left side as you begin to lean over to the right. Now, if your chest starts to turn towards the ground, just open it back up towards the ceiling. Look up to the ceiling if that feels good. You can get a slight bend in that right elbow to help you lean a little bit more to the right. Or you can bring your entire forearm all the way down. Really extend through that left hand, turn that left thumb towards the back wall here. Focus on your breath. Notice if you're holding in tension in that left leg, just release it. Big inhale, feel the entire left side of your body expanding. Don't let your head just dangle there. Work against gravity here. One more big inhale and exhale. Inhale, 
inhale all the way back up both arms up and overhead look up exhale release that left palm down lengthen over towards the left side and again finding what's comfortable within your arms turning your chest towards the ceiling turning that thumb towards the wall behind you focus on the breath breathing into that right lung and lowering in that left arm as needed big inhale and exhale two more breaths here last one great inhale all the way back up bring your palms together interlace your fingers spiral your thumbs and the bottoms of your hands towards the ceiling look up and as we exhale, take your hands to the base of your neck, right where your neck meets your skull. Open your elbows nice and wide here. Sit up tall, press your chest towards the ceiling. Inhale. And as we exhale, round through your spine, pulling your spine to the back wall. Tuck your chin into your chest and allow your elbows to fall forward. No tugging though. Inhale, slow and controlled. Roll up from your pelvic all the way up to your head nice and tall in the spine open up those elbows look up exhale round inhale lengthen exhale round inhale and as we exhale we're going to hold it there lowering those shoulders down away from your ears and just letting gravity do the work here, feeling that stretch from the base of your neck all the way down to your tailbone. You might have a burning sensation through that upper back if you have any tension there. And you can always just lift up slightly if it's too much. Focus on that breath, big inhale. And exhale. In. And out. And one more here. Great, inhale, roll up through that spine, open your elbows, and then release your arms left and right. Rotate your head, spiral through your wrists, find a movement that feels good within your body. And then go ahead and bring your hands right back to your knees. We'll take a breath there, in and out. Inhale, lift your arms all the way up. Exhale, twist over to the left. Catch that right hand on your left knee. Look over your left shoulders. Part your lips just slightly, releasing through that jaw. And really feeling that stretch. Make sure you're sitting up nice and tall, not rounding in your spine. Focus on that breath. Inhale. Exhale, release any tension throughout your body. In. And now, one more breath here. Inhale, come back to center, both arms up and overhead, look up. Exhale, twist to the right this time. Look over your right shoulder. Open up your lips, releasing any tension in your jaw. And then just acknowledge where you might be holding tension in the rest of your body. One more big inhale and exhale. Inhale, arms all the way back up. Exhale, release them down to your side. Now I want you to go ahead and extend your legs nice and wide, coming into a V-sit. You can take the flesh of your buttocks and just kind of roll it out so you're rolling forward in through your hips here. Inhale, lift those arms all the way up. Exhale, fold straight down into the center. And just release your chest forward, trying not to round through your spine too much. Flex your toes towards your face and rotate your knees inward just slightly. Focus on that breath. Inhale. Exhale. See if you can sink a little deeper. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, slow and controlled, roll all the way back up. Inhale, arms up and overhead. 
exhale, release over that right leg, catching your toes if you can, or just right at your shins. And from here, you can drop that right arm right inside of your right leg and lift your left arm all the way up. Try to rotate your chest open towards the ceiling and focus on that breath. Inhale, exhale, inhale all the way back up. Exhale, release over your left leg, focusing on that breath. Go ahead and release that left arm inside of your left leg. Open your right arm all the way up. Look up, turn your chest towards the ceiling here. Play around with the movement in your neck. Maybe you shake it yes and no, left and right. One more breath here, in and out. Inhale all the way back up, arms up and overhead. And exhale, go ahead and release them down. Pull both of your legs in and come into a tabletop position onto all fours. Knees right underneath of your hips, wrists right under your shoulders. Spread your fingertips nice and wide here. And I want you to really press your weight into the knuckles of all of your fingers. Rotate your elbow creases towards that front wall. Take a big inhale, look forward. And as we exhale, I want you to externally rotate. So turn your fingers towards the edge of your mat and then make them point towards your knees here. You can walk your hands a little closer. Make sure your palms are planted on the mat and your fingertips are spread nice and wide. Take a big inhale, lengthen forward. And as we exhale, slow and controlled, sink your hips towards your heels until you can feel a deep stretch within that forearm. Nothing that's gonna cause any pain. You might have a little tension. You might even feel a little bit of burning and that's okay. You just don't want it to be anything that's overwhelming. Inhale, exhale, release your shoulders down away from your ears. And just focus on standing your gaze out past your nose. Focus on that breath. We really work on restoring our body. I'm gonna stay here for three more breaths. Inhale, exhale, in, out, last one. Awesome. Inhale, send your hips all the way back to your heels, lifting your fingers off from the mat and spiral through your wrists here in whatever direction feels comfortable, reversing. Maybe have your hands flat in front of you and shift your hands left and right or flex them towards your face and then down towards your knees. Just really getting some of that wrist mobility. Awesome, and come back into our tabletop position. I want you to go ahead and curl your toes under. Inhale, look forward. And exhale, let it go. Make sure you're pressing into your hands, rotating your elbow creases forward. Take a big inhale, drop your belly, lift your hips towards the sky. And as you exhale, tuck your chin into your chest, pull your spine towards the ceiling and tuck that tailbone under. Inhale, lengthen, drop your belly. And exhale, round. Inhale. And exhale. In. Out. Two more. Last one. Awesome, come back into that tabletop position. Nice neutral spine here. Take a big inhale. And as we exhale, I want you to bump your hips to the left and look over your right shoulder. Part your lips again, releasing through that jaw, pressing firmly into your hands. And just focus on that breath. Inhale, exhale, in, out. One more here. 
Great. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, send your hips to the right side. This time, look over your left shoulder. Focus on that breath. Part your lips just slightly and make sure you're pressing away from that mat. Notice the sensations that come up. Notice where you might have a little stiffness that you didn't realize. And just try to let it go. One more breath here. Inhale, come back to center. Go ahead and open your knees as wide as your mat. Release the tops of your feet down. Bring that right hand underneath of your nose. And with your inhale, open that left arm across the body all the way up to the ceiling. Tuck your tailbone under here. Focus on that breath. Big inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more big breath at the top. Exhale, go ahead and tap your left hand down to the right. Inhale, open it back up. Exhale, tap. Inhale, open. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. One more. Awesome. Release that left hand down and inhale. Open that right arm all the way up. Holding it here in stillness for two breaths. Take one more big inhale and exhale, tap it down. Inhale, open. Exhale, tap. In, out, in, out. Keep it going. Two more. Last one. Awesome. Go ahead and plant your hands. Bring your knees wherever you'd like. You can keep them wide or bring them into the center. And then send your hips to your heels. Release your forehead all the way down. We come into our child's pose. Go ahead and close your eyes. And just focus on that breath. Inhaling in. And out. And bring a big smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of one thing that you're grateful for from today. Next inhale, just lift your forehead away from the mat. Look forward and walk your hands over towards the left side of your mat. You can release your forehead back down and I want you to think of sending that right hip towards the back wall. So you can really feel a lengthening from that right pinky all the way down to your hip. Focus on that breath. Even feel your body weight shifting towards the left side as you rotate in your hips. Focus on that breath, big inhale, and exhale. Two more breaths here. Last one. And with that next inhale, go ahead and walk your hands all the way to the right side of your mat. Sink your hips back towards that left hip, towards the left corner. And just let your head come all the way down, feeling your body shifting towards the left here. Inhale. Exhale. Keep it going. Really focus that breath into the left side, feeling that entire stretch. One more breath here. Awesome. Inhale. We're going to shift onto our belly. And keeping your hands right out in front of you. I want you to lift your head, chin, and chest off from your mat into a baby cobra. 
Really pull your head towards that back wall. Engage your glutes here, keeping that low back nice and stable. Take a big inhale. And exhale, go ahead and release it down. Draw your hands towards your shoulders. Inhale, press up, baby cobra. Really pull your shoulder blades towards your spine and as if you're trying to tuck them in your back pocket. Take a big inhale and exhale, release. Inhale, lifting, baby cobra. Exhale, release. Inhale. And exhale. One more. In. And exhale. Go ahead and extend your arms overhead. Inhale. Exhale. Lift in your hands. That way your thumbs are coming away from the ground. Your hands are perpendicular to the floor here. Inhale, we're gonna lift our head, chin, chest, arms, and legs off of the floor. Feel your pelvic bone pressing into the mat, engage your core. And exhale, let it go. Inhale, lifting. Exhale, lower. Inhale, lift, hold it here. Turn your palms down, and as you exhale, pull your elbows towards your hips. Inhale, lengthen, come forward. Exhale, release it down. Inhale, lifting. Exhale, pull it back. Inhale, forward. Exhale, lower. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, release. We'll do that one more time. In. Out. In. And exhale, release. Awesome job. Go ahead and pull your hands back towards your shoulders. Go ahead and curl your toes under and take a big inhale. Exhale, come back into our tabletop position. Keep those toes curled under. Take another big inhale, nice flat back. And as we exhale, send your hips to the sky. Pull your chest towards your thighs here. Make sure you're turning your biceps towards the ceiling. And it's okay if you have a bend in your knees or if your heels are lifted. That all comes with time. Take a big inhale and exhale. Inhale, I want you to just step that right foot forward. Spiraling onto the bottom of that foot, planting your heel. Get a nice big bend in that front knee. And as you inhale, lift your upper body all the way away from the floor. Focus on your breath here. Turn your chest towards that front wall. Inhale. Exhale, we're gonna open up our arms to the side of the room, turn your chest towards that wall in front of you, and then look over that front hand, warrior two. Focus on your breathing here. Tuck that tailbone under, and just focus on your breath. With that next inhale, you're gonna release your front arm down onto your leg, lift that back arm all the way up. See if you can shift your weight and lower into that lunge. You can either look up, look out, or look down. Find whatever is comfortable for your body here. Inhaling in and out. Feeling the weight in that back foot on the outer edge of the foot, not dropping down into the arch. Really rotate your chest towards the ceiling here, turning that top thumb towards the back wall just slightly. Take one more big inhale and exhale. Bring it all the way back up, warrior two. Lengthen through your front leg, bump your hips to the left, and again, come down into our triangle pose, just releasing that front arm down to wherever it touches. You can always bring that top arm down to your leg, I mean to your hip, <laughs> so you don't have any compression in that shoulder. Take one more big inhale. And as we exhale, go ahead and cartwheel your hands all the way down to the front. Plant those palms, step your foot back. You can always lower onto your knees if you'd like. Take a big inhale, shift your weight forward into plank. Exhale, lower all the way down. Inhale, press into your hands all the way up into our up dog. Engaging through your core here, engaging those glutes. And as you exhale, send your hips to your heels, releasing your Body all the way down to the floor, coming back into our child's pose. 
Focus on that breath. Inhale. And exhale. Big inhale. Big exhale. And go ahead and close your eyes. Bring a big smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of a second thing that you're grateful for from today. With your next inhale, find your flow all the way up to downward facing dog. Making sure that your hands are in the right position. Really pressing into the knuckle of your index finger here. Pulling your chest towards your thighs. Take a big inhale. And exhale. One more breath here. With that next inhale, just take your left foot, shift your weight, step it forward. Rotate that back heel down onto the mat, placing the weight into that outer edge. And with the next inhale, lift all the way up. You can step that back leg in as needed. Focus on your breath. Really shift your hips so they're parallel to the front of your mat. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale, open up, warrior two. Make sure your chest is forward, then look over your hand. Really focusing on that breath. Tucking your tailbone under and looping your shoulders back and down your spine. Inhale and exhale, release that front arm onto that front thigh, lift your back arm all the way up. Rotate your chest towards the ceiling. See if you can sink a little lower here in your lunge. Inhaling in and out. Two more breaths here. Last one. Inhale all the way back up. Warrior two, straighten through that front leg, bump your hips to the wall behind you, and then release into our triangle, allowing that front arm to catch wherever it does on your leg. Focus on your breathing, big inhale, and exhale. One more breath here, in, and as you exhale, cartwheel your hands all the way down, step it back, and move through your vinyasa. And send it back into child's pose. Release your forehead all the way down. You can keep your knees into center if you'd like to open up through the low back, or you can spread them wide as your mat, opening up through your hips. Pull your hands back towards your shoulders here. And if you'd like, you can take your hands and extend them all the way back by your feet, flipping your palms up, really releasing your shoulders forward, and focusing on that breath. Inhale. And exhale. In. And out. Go ahead and close your eyes if you haven't already. Bring a big smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of a third thing that you're grateful for from today.
with your next inhale, bring your hands right under your shoulders if they're not there already. You press your upper body away from the floor. Sending your hips back to your heels, fixing all of your clothes as needed. <laughs> and make sure we're sitting up nice and tall. Loop your shoulders back and down your spine. Take a big inhale. And as you exhale, draw your chin towards that back wall. You can even use your hand to help guide you if you need to. Just focus on that breath. Inhale. Exhale. Send your body weight forward. Curl your toes under. And slow and controlled, send your weight back into your heels. If it's too much of a sensation through the bottom of your feet, just lift your hips slightly. And again, just find something to hold your gaze and just focus on your breath. Inhale. Exhale. In. Out. Two more breaths here. Last one. Great, inhale, shift your body weight forward, send your legs to one side, and then go ahead and release yourself all the way down, extending your legs out in front of you. Go ahead and flex your feet towards your face. Inhale, lift those arms all the way up. Exhale, fold over your legs. Try to internally rotate your legs just slightly, so turn knee to knee or big toe to big toe. And then catch wherever it's comfortable to you. Maybe it's your shins, your ankles, maybe it's the bottom of your feet. And it's okay if you have a bend in your knees here. In time, when you release that low back, you'll feel that lengthening in through your legs as well. Focus on your breath. Big inhale. And exhale. Inhale, roll all the way back up. Sit up nice and tall. Exhale, open your arms out in front of you. Inhale, lengthen, come forward. And as we exhale, we're gonna slow and control, release our upper body all the way down to the floor. Extend your arms out overhead, get a big stretch. And as we exhale, pull your knees into your chest, catch them with your hands, give them a little tug here. Lift that tailbone away from the floor, get a little massage through your low back. And then come back into stillness for a breath. Inhale. Exhale. Great. Go ahead and release that left leg down. You're going to bring your right palm down onto the floor behind you. And then send your knee over to the left side of your mat, keeping your right shoulder blade down onto the ground. Focus on your breath here. Inhale. Exhale. Look towards your right fingers. Inhale, exhale, feel yourself sinking into that twist a little bit more. Two more breaths here. One more. Awesome, come back to center, both knees into your chest, give them a little tug. And then go ahead and release that right leg down. Bring your left palm down onto the floor. And when you're ready, send your left leg over to the right. Keep that left shoulder down onto the mat. And then look towards your left fingers. Focus on your breath. Big inhale. Exhale, sink into the twist. Inhale. Exhale. Two more breaths here. Last one. Awesome. Roll back into the center. Pull your knees into your chest. Give them a little tug. And then allow your feet to just fall to the mat. Step your feet to the outside edges of your mat and allow your knees to come into center to touch. You can have your hands wherever they're comfortable. Maybe you have them on the floor or on your body. And then just begin rocking your legs left and right like windshield wiper motion. Just getting a little extra movement in our hips. Focusing on that breath. Inhaling as you come up. Exhale as you release to one side. And just keep that going. 
noticing the sensations that are coming up within your body. And just really seeing what your body needs, what it's trying to tell you. So remember, our body is not meant to be in pain or uncomfortable. We are meant to feel at ease and to feel energized within our body. So anytime we have anything other than that, that's your body telling you something's going on. Slow down, look within, and respond. We'll do one more each side. Back to center. And then go ahead and release your legs all the way down. Allow your feet to fall open as wide as your mat. And bring your hands down onto the floor, palms open to the ceiling. Go ahead and close your eyes. Take a big inhale in through the nose. And exhale, let it go. Biggest breath you've taken all day. In. And out. Great job. As we move into our final pose, Savasana, this is our time to be still, be present, and just breathe. With your next inhale, go ahead and wiggle your toes, wiggle your fingers, rock your head left and right, and then bat your eyelashes open and closed. And with that next breath, roll onto your side facing me, and we'll take a breath together. Use your arm as a pillow. Inhaling in, and out. Inhale, press yourself away from the floor. Come on all the way back up into a comfortable cross-legged position. Sitting up nice and tall. Hands in your lap, eyes closed. Take a big inhale. And exhale. Bring your palms together all the way up to your forehead. Inhaling in. And out. Be kind in your thoughts to yourself and others. Bring your hands down to your lips, inhaling in and out. Be kind in your words to yourself and others. Bring your hands down to your heart, inhaling in and out. Be kind in your actions to yourself and others. Take one more big inhale. And as we exhale, bow forward. Namaste. Thank you guys for joining me this morning. I hope you are feeling ready for your day, whether it's energized or relaxed or whatever it is that you needed for your body and your mind. So I look forward to seeing you guys again and I hope you have some really awesome festivities today. So I will see you later. Bye.